Seriously, do you want to switch chairs? No, no. I'm fine. Oh, Jerry, you listening to this? Yeah, Uncle Leo. So? So now the Parks Commissioner is recommending Jeffrey for a citation. Right, for the uh, reducing of the pond scum? <laughs> For the walking tours. Oh, yeah, the, uh, where the people eat the plant life, the edible foliage tour. That's exactly right. He knows the whole history of the park. For two hours, he's talking and answering questions. But you want to know something? Whenever he has a problem with one of these high-powered big shots from the parks department, you know who he calls? Mickey Mantle? Jerry, Jerry. Did you taste these peas? These, these peas are great. These peas are bursting with country fresh flavor. Mm, phenomenal peas. Mm. Are you ready for dessert? Well, actually, we do have to kind of get going. You're going? Oh, uh, I don't really eat dessert. I'm dieting. Yeah, I can't eat dessert either. The sugar makes my ankles swell up. And I can't dance. Can't dance? He's kidding, Manya. Is that a joke? <laughs> so, did you hear Claire's getting married? Yeah, yeah. I hear the fella owns a couple racehorses, you know, trotters, like at Yonkers. Horses? They're like big riding dogs. What about ponies, huh? What kind of abnormal animal is that? And those kids who had their own ponies. Oh, I know. I hated those kids. In fact, I hate anyone that ever had a pony when they were growing up. I had a pony. <laughs> well, I didn't uh, really mean a pony per se. When I was a little girl in Poland, we all had ponies. My sister had pony. My cousin had pony. So what's wrong with that? Nothing, nothing at all. I was just merely expressing. Uh, we have some coffee. Who's having coffee? He was a beautiful pony, and I loved him. Well, I'm sure you did. Who wouldn't love a pony? Who wouldn't love a person that had a pony? You. You said so. No, see, we didn't have ponies. I'm sure at that time in Poland, they were very common. They were probably like compact cars. That's it. I had enough. Have your coffee, everybody. She's a little upset. It's been an emotional day. I didn't know she had a pony. How was I to know she had a pony? Who figures an immigrant's gonna have a pony? Do you know what the odds are on that? I mean, in all the pictures I saw of immigrants on boats coming into New York Harbor, I never saw one of them sitting on a pony. <laughs> why, why would anyone come here if they had a pony? Who leaves a country packed with ponies to come to a non-pony country? It doesn't make sense. Am I wrong? <laughs> no, they just left. Oh, my God. Hang, hang on a second. Maybe I can still catch him. Ma! Ma, up here! Don't get in the cab! Manya died! Manya died! <laughs> Who'd you talk to? Uncle Leo. And when's the funeral? I don't know. He said he called back. You know what this means, don't you? We lost the super saver. Those tickets are non-refundable. <laughs> She just had a checkup. The doctor said she was fine. Unless. What? What? Nothing. You don't think. What, the pony remark? Oh, don't be ridiculous. She was an old woman. You don't think I killed her? You know what that flight back will cost us? It was an innocent comment. I didn't know she had a pony. Maybe we could get an army transport flight. They got a base in Sarasota, I think. The whole thing was taken out of context. It was a joke.